Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to another session. This time I'm gonna start making a mediocre one session and I'll start kind of a series that I'll do in this channel. Uh, longer episodes for the meta of the month. Um, this month we got mediocre mon in July and uh, I saw some videos of some people playing like John Dylan and Archisel playing this and also John Origins playing this and I thought that could be cool if I you know, if I try to participate in this metagame too and do a little session of it. So yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing. Um, the team though, it, it's, I don't know, I just try to put some, if you don't play with uh, these mons, it's really hard to win in this tier because everyone is using the best topic they can. And I try to do, you know, well, you'll see, you, as you can see the team, whatever. Uh, I have a Polyrath, it's a bulk up sub, Focus Punch, Waterfall, Polish Polyrath, and it's actually really good, I love this thing, it's really bulky, and uh, it takes special hits for days, and you can set up really easily on Dewgongs, and stuff like that, so yeah, I really like this guy on the team, and he, it's it's working pretty well, and also Focus Punch, even though I'm not max invested, 95 base attack, and a focus punch, it hurts. It always hurts. Now I have one of the beasts of the team. <laughs> Ferris, this thing is really good. I love this thing in this tier. Uh, put all, all kinds of hazards, stop uh, stop sweeps from uh, from happening. Thanks for Thunder Wave. I just have Seed Bomb just in case I have to hit Quaxar for a little bit of damage, I guess. Because <laughs> Quaxar is everywhere. And then, you know, hazards, nothing too special about it, just a defensive set. It's really bulky. Now I have. Um, Neither Queen also it's uh, it's max special attack but it's uh, a defensive nature just to have a little bit some more bulk on this team because it's pretty frail like this this uh, yeah now I just like to be able to take any hit and then retaliate back with any uh, with any attack I actually don't think Roar is the best moves right now because it, it was defensive first but well actually with all the hazards I can boot with this and bound with this. Uh, what what is this? Not normal. <laughs> just one roar. Uh, roar is actually pretty useful. It's situational, but it can work. Then we have Zatu. It's uh, an offensive set. It's actually kind of to check uh, Venomoth with the Psy Shock, and you you, you can put you to sleep because magic bounce. And then we have Grass Knot for Quaxar, because it hurts more than uh, Giga Drain, I think. And uh, then I have heat wave just to you know to have some coverage. Fire or grass coverage is good. They have Gabite is a scarfer. It's actually pretty decent. I like this. Uh, not the best of the team. It haven't been done in the test rounds, but I I really do like this set too because I wanted to try something different too that in this team apart from Polyrath. Uh, it has Dragon Claw, Earthquake, Stone Edge, and Outrage, nothing too fancy about him. And then I have Gold Batman, this time he's a special defensive set. Same set as always, as I always use since 5th gen. Braver, Toxic, Roost, and now in this gen gets Defog, which is much better. And it's actually this Pokemon that makes this team better, because before before this team was, was pretty, it was, it sucked. <laughs> so yeah, let's try and have uh, 3 or 4 battles, you know. And see if this team is decent or not. Oh my god, this team. This is what I'm. This is what I'm talking about. This is pretty, really hoary team. But uh, I guess we'll deal with it. I don't know. All right. This lets to lead and go for knockoff. I can wall this with Zatu. I can. Uh, I can bring Zatu on this. I guess. All right. New meta of the month series. First battle against the horrors of the teams. <laughs> Alright. Mm, I don't know what to bring. I guess Nido Queen hits pretty well. Zatu, actually. Uh, maybe not. His Zatu hits a lot of my dudes. Yes. I'll leave with Nido Queen. He needs with Sableye, yes. So he was planning on do that. I'll just hit I'll just hit this. I have HP Grass on this just to, just for Quagsire. Does it special defensive and he goes for knockoff, gets a crit. God damn it. I hate those things. Now they get knockoff too. <sighs> right. He's gonna burn me. And I, and I kill him with a crit. Awesome. That's what you deserve. 
boy. <laughs> my Hibernian Quacks are. I'm gonna show now the HP Grass. It's not that common, doesn't do that much, but uh, yeah. I just deal damage to this, and uh, I'm probably gonna die. Maybe it does more, actually, and actually, Hidden Power Grass is useless. We'll see. Yeah, it doesn't do that much, but it's a, an amount of HP that I think it can die from a grass nut, so I'm gonna bring that right now and just go for it. Even if he switches, I don't think he has very good switches into this. Yeah, Quaxer, I know, it's a pain. I'm not, I'm not sure about HP grass damage, it's not hurting that much. Does it get grass nut? No. What about fire blast? It gets fire blast. Yeah, and he stays in, in. I actually got rid of this threat, which is beautiful. Now he's gonna bring the other threat, though. But I think I have a pretty safe switch in Golbat. This Golbat has a lot of. Uh, yeah, it can take the hits. Has a lot of. Um, I have some attack investment, too. So it hits. It actually hits pretty hard with. Uh, with Brave Bird. Actually, I'm just gonna roost, just in case he decides to continue. Uh, going for Ice Beam. I think I'll be faster than this, yeah. Alright. It was Gotha Rita though, that's actually pretty threatening because I cannot switch. I'll Toxic really quick this thing. And he's... Oh. Actually I can tell I can install this thing out. I think I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Thunder Wave. Yeah, that was a good play because I don't have Heal Bell. And now I'm slower than him so I'll decide just to attack now. Or actually I could just continue with Roost. No, I'm just gonna attack. There's no point in making this longer. I will try to roost in at any other point, I think. A special defensive goal, goal but he's like, oh, he has heal bell. All right, I get paralyzed. <laughs> God damn it. Then I'll just have to go for Brave Bird. Deal damage. Yeah, that's, that's decent damage. I like this. Uh, and I'll just toxic before dying. Please, go bad, please. So now I'll force him to kill me, because if he if he goes for heal bell and I don't get paralyzed, I'll kill him. If he wanna keep this, so the, also I don't think why he would ever do that, but you know. You never know. Right, he, exactly. He decides to attack. I'm just gonna bring, uh, I was about to bring Zatu, but I guess I kinda have to, right? Yes. He's probably gonna die from poison. So I'll just hit him with a grass knot again. I can break his own side. I'll just go for heat wave. Whatever. <sighs> he has pretty good synergy with these things. That is good, man. In this in this tier meta game. I love it. So John Origins. The sexiest man, yeah, with uh, with this Zatu, I thought it was a good idea with the Psyshock. Do I have free chains for this? Not really, I'll just stay and deal damage. Oh my god! <laughs> oh shit, I actually needed that for Clafki. That will be fine. Yeah. If he's smart, I'm just gonna go for Dragon Claw, if he brings Clef, heats, whatever. Uh, yes. Uh, Earthquake is safer, but then he has Zatu. It's just a 50 50. Let's go for this. He brings Zatu, predicted him ground attack. I did well though, then. And I think. Uh, I'll just go for more damage. I want him to bring Klefki, actually. Yes, there we go. Oh, he has Roost. And Lefties. Hmm. Ah, uh, this Zatu. I'm, I'm just gonna try to get the crit right now. It's not... It's not going anywhere, though. I'm, I, you're not accomplishing anything. You have to attack me. Or bring your Klefki. There we go. And uh, I'll just continue to go for that. He brings a Klefki now, that's fine. It's exactly, if he doesn't have Toxic, I'll be fine, because I'll bring now Polyrath. He puts a spike, that is perfect, because I'll try to go for shop. He goes for T-Wave. I'm slow with balls anyways. <laughs> and I think I have a free ball cup now. Don't I? He has to switch. And if, if I get paralyzed, I'm still behind the shop, so... 
Para is probably gonna be a little bit annoying, but let's hope it doesn't happen. I should have changed the background though. I haven't. Oh well. <laughs> Foul play doesn't do enough because this thing is really bulky and now with the ball cup I don't think he'll be able to break it. Yeah. I'll just keep going for ball cup and now I'll sub because I think he's gonna break the sub. Yes. Yes, I'll do that. There we go. I don't get paralyzed, which is awesome news. And now I think a focus punch is gonna hurt someone. In the face. Oh no, god damn it, the critical hit. That was bullshit. Oh, and he still lives. That's actually cool. Because I can stop again. <laughs> don't get paralyzed, please. Don't do it. Alright, right, perfect. He won't be able to add speed, but uh, whatever. It's fine. Yeah, that could that actually can break the sub, that's fine. The thing is, I'm I probably can take a side shock and maybe a psychic from these Z2. I just have to attack now. Oh dazzling gleam, of course I can leave that for sure. Yes! Polyrath! Pulling through, and he forfeits. Awesome. Uh, we have one battle. Let's do a couple more. I don't know. I don't know if I want to do this in a long part in a session. I just like sessions more. Yeah, I'll do that in a session. So see you in the next part. I will do.